have an ambitious um, talk that I have planned for you all, and I have um, the cane ready to hook me off in about 15, 20 minutes, so hopefully I'm going to get through everything. But um, it's really such an honor to be here amongst these ter terrific speakers that you guys all have lined up. And I wanted to start by asking everybody, what would you think if I had a jar of magic pills? Magic pills that you can take every single day. They were inexpensive. They could boost your mood and your energy, help you to lose weight. They can enhance the beauty of your skin and your hair, lower your cholesterol, your blood pressure, and they taste absolutely delicious. There's no downside, and they're backed by scientific studies. Would you take them? Yeah, I would too. <laughs> well, seriously, the pills do exist. And you can buy them right in your local grocery store. You can bring them home and stash them in your kitchen. Food is that powerful. And by eating the right foods, you really can help to treat, to manage, and sometimes even reverse common health conditions. So today, I'm really excited because I'm not going to tell you what you can eat. I'm going to tell you what you can eat that will really help to catapult you to the top of your game. So I'm going to handpick five superfoods, and we're going to walk through them. And I'm going to convince you that right after this talk, you have to run to the grocery store and pick them up and bring them home. So the first one may be a little bit surprising to you because it comes out of a can. Canned 100% pure pumpkin puree. So why pumpkin? Well, pumpkin gets its bright orange hue from two carotenoids. Those are antioxidants. One is called beta carotene, and the other one is called beta cryptoxanthin. And together, we have research that shows that these antioxidants can help reduce the risk for certain inflammatory arthritis, like rheumatoid arthritis. So that alone is really exciting. But beta carotene is also like nature's exfoliant. It helps to shed off the old skin cells and lay down beautiful, radiant, new skin cells so you've got this glowing, youthful complexion. Huge selling point, right? Absolutely. So it gets even better. Pumpkin is also a super good source of potassium. And most people know that eating a salty diet will increase your blood pressure, right? Well, potassium is sort of like the anti-sodium because potassium in the body helps to offset the damage that sodium does. So it makes a lot of sense. The more potassium-rich foods that you eat, the better chance you have of normalizing your blood pressure. So how do you get this pumpkin in? I do all sorts of clever things with pumpkin, and it's really easy to work with. And of course, I love fresh pumpkin, but they're only available one or two months out of the year. And if you do put the energy and effort into cooking with it, awesome. That's fabulous. But during the rest of the year, you definitely can work with this pumpkin puree. So I add a scoop into oatmeal with a little bit of maple syrup and vanilla extract, um, and if you want nuts or fresh fruit in there as well. I add it into my taco meat filling. My kids have no idea what they're eating when I serve them tacos. <laughs> I also put it in marinara sauce, and then I'll take that concoction and I'll just toss it with some whole wheat penne. So it's very, very versatile. And one of the most delicious things that I do, I make this like decadent, scrumptious, pumpkin pudding for only 150 calories. So you'll have to try this later on today. A vanilla Greek nonfat yogurt, and I mix it with a dollop of the pumpkin puree, a dash of vanilla extract, and a little bit of ground cinnamon or nutmeg. 150 calories, and I swear it tastes just like pumpkin pie filling. So your homework now is going to be to pick up, whoops, pick up a can of this pumpkin puree, and within the week, I want you to try to finish it up. Doable? Okay, good. 